He's outside in an AMG GT. Something, something. Two turn, baby, and you know me. Hey guys, it's Kim G, and welcome to another vlog. Oh my god, it is Pride Weekend in the San Francisco Bay Area, so I don't know if you guys know what that means, but what that means is it's about to be turn up, turn up, turn up, like Farmer McGregor's Garden. Turnips everywhere. I just left OS Day. Now, I ain't, don't stop saying it's my, one of my favorites. It's not one of my favorites. It's just a very local and convenient place to go eat and drink around a civilized group of people and that's what I did and in the midst of doing that I ran into some co-worker friends and they're a younger crowd they're like in their 30s <laughs> and they were like Kim Kim with the Y we love you Kim with the Y oh my god OG 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 I hate it when they be like that but I'd be like okay whatever and they were like come with us come with us um there's not gonna be anywhere to park it's I'm definitely not going anywhere near San Francisco this weekend because it's gonna be filthy hella piss hella drunk people, hella kids, hella vagrants. And I'm not gonna be dealing with that. Um, but downtown Oakland, cause Oakland's so liberal and they love everything and everybody no matter what. Um, they're all down here now. It's their pre-gaming for the weekend. And I just wanna make sure I get into the little space. I need to call this nigga on Instagram. When you don't have people's phone number, you can call them on Instagram. That'd be so cool. Bro, because there's nowhere to park. I don't, I don't, I don't. And it's a concert going on down here at the Fox. I would never, ever call it on Instagram. But I'm about to. Because I don't have your phone number. Oh, I don't even know what I'm doing. I need to not even try to make these little Instagram phone calls. How did y'all find a park, though? Y'all so lucky. Y'all so lucky, y'all call you <laughs> that's crazy here's our lucky uh Like one, two, three, four, five, six. Look, blood. I'm just gonna show y'all this. This is how crazy Oakland is. They leave their windows completely down in the back and in the front and unlocked. Don't break my windows. Just go in there and do what you think you might wanna do. <laughs> what y'all think y'all going through? <laughs> We be like, you can't even, no, you, listen, look, look, look. Are you by yourself? Are you by yourself? Are you by yourself? You know what, guys? I really wanted to pick up my camera a long time ago. Like, um, I really just faced my fear. I just had, I've had, I have a lot of anxiety about things. Avoidance and denial, two of my biggest toxic traits. And I say toxic because it's toxic for me. It has nothing to do with any one of y'all because it just doesn't. But I just been at my family's house for the last six hours, literally. Um, and I wish I didn't have to go. I wish I wasn't compelled to go there under these circumstances, but my cousin is very ill, terminally ill. And um, my oldest, eldest is really sick. And um, it, there's so much about me that I don't really share. And I don't really necessarily need to share. But I have estranged relationships with people in my family and, you know, friends and all kinds of stuff. But more so, my family and I have been estranged on certain levels. And that's because I have a avoidance and um, denial issues. Um, I be denying a lot of stuff. And I avoid a lot of stuff because I just don't want to deal with the shit. Like, because I don't know how to properly deal with my emotions and everything, you know, like it got to the point for me, like I felt like a stranger in my own family. 
And um, anyway, I and I will respond accordingly. That's how I was feeling. Like fuck this shit, y'all. Y'all treat me like this. I'm, well, it is what it is, and this is how we gonna do it. But anyway, long story short, um, and that, a lot of that shit was me though, cause I just, I, cause there's things I be wanting to address, but I be feeling like it's gonna fall on deaf ears. So I don't. Uh, these motherfuckers be out here sick in Oakland. I'm not even gonna do what I was gonna do, like show you this sick person working my god I'm not even gonna do that like oh my god this city is okay anyway so I just I faced my fear today I, I was really anxious about it um I was really anxious about it and um anyway I'm not gonna I'm not gonna Oh, I, I lost my train of thought because I'm just thinking to myself like it shouldn't my family um I can't talk about this <laughs> I can't talk about this oh guys it is later on in the day mm, mm, mm. I'm gonna have to get my ass in the shower for real you cannot wear flip-flops outside and just think that <laughs> it's gonna be good be gonna be dirty period so I'm just home I'm about to eat this bolognese and rigatoni basically spaghetti and catch up on a little YouTube. I've been away from my house for hours. Ugh. It feels good to be home. I was so hungry, I didn't have time to wait to eat because I'm starving. Because literally, me and my cousin was eating pretzels. Not that there wasn't no food in the house, but because, you know, just what's going on, no one's really cooking because, you know, my aunt's not really hungry and everyone's kind of, you know, anxious or whatever. I mean, my cousin, I, I call her my aunt because of that age difference, but she's really my cousin. But. I knew I had this left over from last night. I was like, ooh, I just get home, just get home. And there's a lot of little content to watch today. And um, yeah, it, there's something for everybody. There's something for everybody on this motherfucker. I ordered some stuff, not from Instagram, but because of Instagram. This teeth whitening stuff, it's basically some purple tooth cleaner it's supposed to like erase the yellow so we about to see um after i eat my dinner tonight when i brush my teeth tonight i'll probably try it if not in the morning because i'm gonna see and if it don't work out right i swear to god i'm returning this shit period i am returning this shit that does not work out you're not keeping my money return to sender go make me some money Good morning, guys. So, um, as I mentioned, I'm highly influenced. Okay? And I don't know how they started following me on Instagram, but I tapped in and it's a teeth brightening serum that literally has been stalking me on Instagram for the last couple of days and it's called High Smile. And basically, it is a color correcting serum. And from what it appears, the serum is purple and the purple cancels out the or helps correct the yellow tinge or tint to your teeth naturally allegedly in one to two uses so i immediately ordered this off of amazon they have their own website of course but I'll, of course you know i'll check for things on amazon to see how fast i can get it the return policy yada 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 found it i can't remember exactly how much it cost it came same day i ordered it yesterday morning it came the same day um and i said i'm gonna go ahead and try it today and i'm gonna try it on camera so we can see legitimately at the same time you know what it do this product is not a substitute for toothpaste but i'm gonna be gentle with the box because like I said, if this product does not work the way they say it's gonna work. One, two. So as you can see, my teeth have a yellow tinge. You know, I've had these teeth, these set of teeth for like what, it's 38 years. You know, you get your teeth when you're like seven after the baby ones fall out. Anyway, these are yellow. I drink tea, coffee, I smoke, so I drink red wine. Why am I doing that one? <laughs> <laughs> these are my teeth. Ooh, these people are savage. Okay, let me go ahead and turn it on now. Oh, oh God. Mm. 
Uh, uh, I don't know. <laughs> I'm going to try it for two or three days and see. Like, I really can't tell lip. Try it again. Um, I'm going to try it again tonight. And I'm going to try it again in the morning. And I'm going to see. And I'm going to go outside and look at natural sunlight and see. I almost want to say yes. But I don't know. Three tries. I'm going to do it tonight. I'm going to do it tomorrow. And I'm going to see. And I'll keep you guys updated on this high smile. Keep the box intact. Because, honey, this will go back. You're not going to just take it. So it better be. It better be Poppington. Man, <laughs> I just had the craziest conversation in the restaurant uh, with some ladies about the BET Awards last night. I didn't even watch the BET Awards last night because I don't even know when that shit comes on. I don't even really care. I don't really need to see the performances. I really don't care about any of these, you know, new age performers. But they, I guess it was ladies night and all the ladies was doing all the, you know, the, the you know pound town and then you know all the you know, all the shit that they're doing now which is okay because i understand how a lot of ogs feel because i feel the same way too like women are just really aggressive you know what i mean like they're so hard it's i don't even imagine how a man could really be like attracted to a one of these new age women because they're so rougher and you know it's okay to be independent right but to be so rough and tell a nigga you snap you know like he ain't shit and fold him up like you know i don't know what i don't know what the girl I, I don't even know what the lyric they, the lyrics be so rude and they be the women the bitches be rude to each other i you know <laughs> you know they would not speak like that and carry themselves that way and you know you can be strong and independent and progressive and responsible and you know you know like standing on your principles and all that but you ain't gotta be like disrespectful and just nasty and vulgar and rude and ratchet ratchet is for spring break when you just want to not be a lady they don't never be ladies it's just ratchet 24 7 anyway the OGs was having conversation. It was some old OGs, and then there was like girls, women my age. In there it was like one Queen Latifah like. <laughs> we emulate our my, our parents. We emulate our surroundings. So it's just I, I it's purely based on their surroundings, like what what they're producing. And it's unfortunate, but such is a life. <laughs> I just need to know. Where is that light coming from? Like, Betty or Val, is that you? With me in this, like, it's like a little white. And it's only in the car when I see it. So I'm like, where is that light? What is doing that? What is causing that? That is so crazy. <sighs> Why is this car with no lights on behind me? Go somewhere else. Or turn your lights on, cause I don't like that behind me and it's dark on dark. You know, do you ever just check on your strong, you know, check on your strong cousins, check on your strong friends, cause you never really know what's going on with them. Yeah. Don't fret, we about to have a tree treat. Here's $15 worth of meat. Don't you just love Whole Foods? One pound of this organic honey roasted turkey breast or turkey was $14.99. I wanted a sandwich for lunch today. Um, so I'm going to try it. Mm. Mm -hmm. Oh, God. I never have nothing when I'm something. 
It's actually really good. I look forward to, yes, I put my dirty ass hand in my bag of meat. Save your judgment. Um, mm, this is good. Enjoy it, relax, savor it, Lily. Okay, perfect. Mmm, I'm excited. And also, I got these walnut cookies. Instead of my favorite butter, brown butter cookies, I'm gonna try these walnut cookies because they were on sale and you get more. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna have to have one now. You never go in that place when you're hungry. Never. <laughs> my body don't be as cute as I be thinking it is. <laughs> we need to make lunch. The, what the? 90 down the hill. pool today it's a great day um everyone doesn't have monday off so like as far as me wanting to get together with friends and family to do something for the holiday we would have done it today but i'm doing this damn open house from two to four this is the last time i'm done i'm just i cannot be in an empty on stage house with no chair no nothing to look at i can't do it but they did a really good job in here so yeah of the paper don't burn up in the morning let it take not me sitting at the oil changers watching my own vlogs <laughs> but you funny you real motherfucking funny Because I've just been um, really busy. Can brush your hair a little bit. Um, brush your hair a little bit. 